Today I'm going to be showing you how to brush out your Bright Here, Bright Now scarf. For the purpose of this demonstration, I will be using these two tools that you see pictured here. This tool right here is a standard pet grooming slicker brush. And if you notice, this one has um, the metal bristles that are kind of angled at the end. And I have found that this is important when brushing out the fibers um, to really get the fibers to kind of pull out. Um, and then this brush right here, um, I actually picked up at Lowe's and it is kind of hard nylon bristles. And this brush I will use to smooth out the work of the slicker brush. So I tried a couple different tools and I worked on a couple different swatches to find the technique that I thought looked the best. And these two tools achieve that look. So the slicker brush is really going to pull out the fiber. As you see here, I um, already worked this section so that you could see the look of what the fabric will look like. And so the point of brushing it out is to really pull those fibers up, out so that it creates this kind of watercolor look across your stripes. Um, the slicker brush I noticed when doing this, it tended to create more of a matted look. So that's where this brush really um, became useful and handy because you will then brush over top of that to really smooth those fibers out to get that beautiful brushed out look on your fabric. So I am using a Surrey Alpaca Silk Yarn. This will also work if you are using a mohair yarn, um, but you definitely want to use a fluffy fiber in doing this. So I started at the halfway point of my scarf, which was this stripe right here. Um, and you just want to, so I start with the slicker brush first and you want to hold the scarf tight on the on your working surface and you just want to brush in kind of short quick strokes that are in an upward motion so you just want to pull that out and as you can see Sometimes you get like a little end that pops out and that's no big deal. You just kind of like pull it and it'll go back in. Um, but if you see, the slicker brush does kind of give it more of a matted look. So then you just take that nylon bristle brush and come in and brush over top of it. And that kind of like smooths all those fibers out and gives you more of that like watercolor look. I mean, look how beautiful that looks. So for the scarf, you'll just start in the middle, like I said, and you'll want to brush towards you and we'll be brushing towards the one end down here. Okay. So you're going to brush all the way across that scarf end, and then you will start and do the other end in the opposite direction. So I'm going to brush another section here so that you can see, um, how to do it again. So you just holding the scarf tight and don't worry, like see sometimes like an end pops out there and because it's a tube, just go ahead and keep tugging on it until it goes back in. Like so. And because the scarf is a tube, you will need to do um, the backside as well. So I'll be doing that. And I know this kind of looks aggressive, but the fabric can, can handle it. And then again, just kind of go in and brush over top of it like so. It's a kind of unmat the fabric. And it really does create such a cool look. scarf up out of the way here. It 
And as you can see, I really am only kind of using this section of the brush. So I am working at kind of an angle to do those short upward strokes. Okay, I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to continue working down the um, till the end of the scarf and then I will be back to show you what it looks like and how to begin on the other side. So I did want to show you um, kind of a close-up of what the fabric looks like when you just use the slicker brush. As you can see kind of like across these fibers right here, it it is more matted and not um, kind of the blended, smoothed out um, watercolor look that I'm going for. So that is where this brush really just comes in handy because it just smooths everything out. And as you can see, how, how much better that looks. and just clean your brush off and keep going. And to show you a before and after, so this is what it looks like after, but this is what the fabric looked like before. And so this side is done and now we are going to work on the other side. So again, just holding the scarf um, tight to your surface and working in short upward strokes you're just going to brush out this side and as you can see some of those ends have popped through and that's okay because we will fix that in a second I'm just going to take the slicker brush and work all the way down this side of the scarf and then take the nylon um, bristle brush and go over top. Okay, so now that both sides have been brushed out, you're going to just flip the scarf over and repeat the entire process starting in the middle and brushing towards one end and then coming back to that middle point and brushing towards the other end. And then that's it. That is how you brush out your Bright Here, Bright Now scarf. And in fact, you can actually use this technique on sweaters or any other accessories um, that you have knit in either a mohair yarn or a Surrey alpaca yarn.